The wait is over. There are few bigger days on the football calendar than Champions League final day. Fans are beginning to pour into the stadium and the tension is palpable. It's Manchester City, they take on Leipzig and it's live on EA TV. And now the night everyone in the football world has been longing for. Millions will be watching around the world. It is, of course, the biggest final in club football, the UEFA Champions League final. Welcome to the commentary box. Derek Ray here, joined by Stuart Robson. It is Manchester City facing RB Leipzig. Well, Derek, you just wonder what those players are thinking right now. Some will be nervous, some will be excited, and some may be anxious. But once that whistle blows, we're going to be in for an absolute classic here. Starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson between the posts. Nathan Ake plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Riyad Mahrez plays with Phil Foden out wide. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. And here's how Leipzig will line up. Well, 4-4-2 against 4-4-2. That certainly takes me back. But I think this will come down to who wins the battle in central midfield because there's four very good players in there. This is it, the Champions League final. They are underway. Who will be crowned Club Kings of Europe? Ake. Phil Foden now. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. De Bruyne. On to Silva. Well, beating his opponent. Chance here. And they scored! First goal in this season's UEFA Champions League final. Well, just look at the setup here. It's such a clever back heel, but the keeper should do better at his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. And Leipzig get us moving again. A quick reply required after the disappointment of conceding. Konrad Leimer. Possession one. Now a potentially dangerous position for City. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Mares. Now with Ronaldo. Oh, surely. And a goal to increase the lead in this final. Will they be stopped now? Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. He skips past his marker and that gives him the space to get his shot away. Excellent stuff from him. And the ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. Cristiano 
And he has options available. Mares. Hold on. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. Konrad Leimer. Well, spot on with that challenge. Ronaldo. This looks more than decent. Nicely blocked, but he's got to get rid of it. Nkunku. Well, time just challenged magnificently. Well, as the stats confirm, City have controlled the ball and have used it really well today, particularly in the midfield areas. And I expect more of the same as the game goes on. And he read it well. The referee has decided to give the free kick decision the way of City. Well, that's not how they rehearsed it on the training ground. Yeah, and I'm not sure what was going through his mind there. That was a poor decision to shoot from that distance. And City recovering possession well. Forsberg a real struggle to contain him and the counter attack is on options available well they've lost possession of the ball that is that for the first half here Into the second half then, in this battle for Champions League glory. Andre Silva. Lima on the ball. Forsberg. And no worries for the goalkeeper. Kevin De Bruyne. A super tackle and they've won possession. Now options are plenty. But really sticking to their task defensively. And they need to get tighter here. Now will the cross work out for them? And a promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end. Ronaldo wasteful in possession, not really like him. So Bosloy, Andre Silva, it's opening up for them. Surely. Oh, keeper dealt with it. So the corner played into the box. Well, dealt with that ball comfortably. Schlager. Andre Silva, that's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. <laughs> 
now sending it in well, it still could be dangerous danger averted for now that's useful play Foden he read the situation defensively and did his job now counter attacking possibilities here a really sumptuous ball Nkunku and a really single minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened Erling Haaland well they have the ball once more five minutes to go and very deftly cut out and the advantage is with City And there it is, full-time, Manchester City, Champions League winners. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Manchester City. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. The Champions League victors, Manchester City.